welcome back. Today we're going to be going over my Ipsy Glam Bag for the month of May. Kind of excited. I got here super de duper late, but here we are. Um, I'm going to open it with you guys, kind of go for a little bit of what I got, and then try on anything if I can. Let's get started. come in the bag itself but let's get started I have everything pulled up on my phone here so I can kind of give a little rundown this month for May 2020 it is called get that glow that is the theme of the box um, or the bag I should say ipsy glam bag not box and hmm, a little bit about the bag it says this ombre bag makes magic hour any hour so discover the glow that is right at your fingertips and i am and i like it the first item is going to be the siate london fierce flicks in black that is the eyeliner let's dig in oh i forgot they do tend to come with these cute little cards that kind of give you a rundown of what exactly is in your bag so or not normally it does but this one doesn't it kind of gives you an idea of what the theme the may 2020 get that glow theme is all about but then on the inside it kind of gives you a rundown on how to use different products like highlighter powder liquid and cream and on the back it goes over the add-ons but it does not give you information on what's in the bag okay this is kind of cute though i mean i think that's handy it tells you the save the date for when you can do your choice they let you choose one product every month to start your bag out with and then they build it after that for you so kind of cute lets you know what day it is um if you want to do add-ons as well when it comes out how much they are how many you can add on cost is always free for it so that's always great so although this isn't a very useful card for this glam bag, it's still pretty handy overall. So let's dig in. This will be the Siate London Fierce Flicks liner. This is kind of cute. Not for resale. I am digging it comes fully wrapped so you know it is new and secure and safe to use right away roughly if you can open it kudos to you if you can open it oh no okay there we go that's better why do I always struggle so much with these? That's why. Uh, huh, got it. Okay, so you can see the full product now. It is really shiny and that's kind of cute. I like that. And it is the felt tip brush. So pretty nice. I'm gonna I love how black that comes out. That's really nice. It does take a moment to dry but that is a really cute black. Like it is dark dark. I don't necessarily need it for going out today but I think I'm gonna try it on real quick just to get a better idea of what all is going on here so give me like a second to you five minutes for me 
Yeah, that's fair. We are rough and tough. Look at that. Pretty nice. And this thing is a beast. Mm. It's okay. It is definitely not my best work. Oh, by far. So, okay. Alright. So, good as we're going to get it. And this is a team effort. We fail together, we succeed together. This is pretty nice. I like the intensity of the black, as you can see. This tip, though, does not bend for nothing. It's not going nowhere. So if you want a thin line, you better hold it up straight. You want a thick line, go ahead and lean it on over, son, because that's what I got. Mm. Still looks okay. I'm not, I'm not mad at it. I'll just buff it out with eyeliner later. I'll just buff it out with eyeshadow later. Mm. Numero Dos. It is a Peach Blossom Lip Balm by Lasting Smiles. Let me dig in here for this. Cute. Oh, look at that. I like the color. I also love, love, love lip balms, chapsticks, lip oils, whatever you want to call them. I, I have a super soft spot for them. I'll wear these with, without makeup, doesn't matter. This is my go-to. I wear this to bed when I wake up throughout the day. I reapply these like crazy. So, definitely a plus. Oh, look. It's got a little baby peach right there. Peach. Smile for a cause supports global water projects. Cool beans. Organic lip, lip balm in peach blossom and it is leaping bunny so that means it is not tested on animals love that hmm can't really smell it could be the caffeine who knows let me just pop some on Oh, that's soft. Okay, I can smell it now. There's like little protective barrier. Mmm. But no, I can smell it now. And that is delish. This is going in my bag. Like, right now. Mmm. I can still smell it. It smells like peach. So that one is a plus. I like that one a lot. Let's move on to the Ferro brushes. It is a large blender in... 25EL. That'll be this little fella. Cute. I'm going to add this to my brushes. I'm always super stoked to get brushes because, let's be honest, I don't like to wash my brushes. So when they get dirty, I can put them aside and grab a new one. Perfect. But I love these. I love the fair brushes I get. They're so nice. I want to just slip it out. I can. There we go. Okay, that's soft. I like the colors too, though. Is that not adorbs? And on the back, it gives you the name. But I mean, it doesn't necessarily have to be for blending. You can use brushes for whatever you want to. Sometimes I go in. This one's my favorite right now. I've been using this one pretty much for everything throughout my makeup process. I'll use my dry brush cleaner and just kind of wipe it off in between different colors and it comes out amazing. So you can use your brushes for whatever you want to. Next is the Pearlesque Beauty Coconut Oil and Pulmeria Sky Body Butter. Butter. My butter. Oh, this one's a hefty one. Look. Cute. Okay. Smooths, hydrates, nourishes, and deeply moisturizes for all skin types. 
I have a skin type, so that's perfect because I'm all. Beauty through Asian wisdom. Cute. Hmm. I just want to see what it smells like. Oh, here's a little protective barrier. Mm, you can still smell it though. It smells pretty nice. Okay. This is so nice. This is probably good for like one full body application, but still good. I am excited to try this. And it's super cute packaging too. Come on. Next, we have the Tarte Shea. Oi. I mispronounce things. So next, we have the Tarte C H2O Lip Gloss. Gloss Lip Gloss in Sail Away. Okay, that's confusing, but it says I picked this item, so... I love Tarte though. And it is in the shade sale away. And this little cute, oh, little, so little. Cute though. I do love Tarte. And it looks pretty cute for being such a tiny size. I love little sizes though. Like, I just have to say, at least for my lips, because I can take. A million of these on the go or if it's just me and I only want to grab like my wallet I can slide this into my pants pocket real quick and use this all day because it's so tiny so compact I want to try it got my chapstick now let's do lip gloss oh you see that you didn't see that slimy okay so, one more time for the folks at home. I really hope it doesn't do this again. Oh. That is not... That's not attractive. It smells okay, so let's give it a try. This is really nice. It smells really good. Aside from being kind of slimy there, I like this color. And it gives my lips that nice shine effect. I'll take it. Not like I have a choice. Plus, I mean, I did have a choice, and that was my choice, so that's what I picked. But, you know. And then one more thing, I actually did an add-on where I purchased some things separately from what I would normally get in my glam bag. And they sent it to me with my glam bag. It is a lip lore gloss in the shade of Jealous of Us. And this is cute packaging. I like that. And you can see the shade right here, Jealous of Us. Let me pop this open so we can see. Ooh, that is cute. It's so weird that this one is so much bigger than this little fella. So cute though. Still love them both. This one is nice. And this one is all shiny. It's got a little red peach in there. You got like the terracotta e color but it's a little bit more sparkly peach or at least it's terracotta with sparkles in the shade of peach yeah we'll go with that so that was my add-on this i believe i paid three dollars for and it ships free with my bag so that was definitely good love 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 and of course you have this adorable little bag that you get to keep great for summer also has a little Ipsy logo on the inside as well as outside and not on the tag. Sometimes I do the tag too, but it doesn't look like this time they did. But this is adorbs. Perfect for summer. Look at that. And then I'm going to place everything back in here. So I got one, two, three, four, five products. And this does come monthly, so you can subscribe, I believe, monthly for $12, or if you do the year subscription, I think it's a little bit cheaper. 
Um, I do the year at a time though, just because out of all the subscription boxes I've done regarding makeup at least, Ipsy has never really let me down with anything. Maybe once or twice there's been like a few items I just don't care for, but I use them eventually or I find somebody else who can use them eventually. And the majority of the bag is something I love. So always a good thing with Ipsy, but I'm going to keep on keeping on with Ipsy. Let me know if you got Ipsy Glam Bag, how you like it. If you have the Glam Bag Ultimate, the Glam Bag Plus, I forget. They have the same thing as BoxyCharm now where they have tiers to what you can get every month. There's 12, 25, and $50 a month, I believe. So different things you can get, different amount of makeups, different sizes too. This one, it's gonna be mostly sample and deluxe sizes you're gonna get. The other ones, I think you get deluxe and full sizes a bit more, but definitely worth it for this, for me, for this month. Let me know what you got in your Ipsy bag, and thanks for hanging out. I will catch you next time. Don't forget to do the like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And yeah, okay, bye.